to your honey. See that you stun me. Your body is so good and plenty. Looking at your lips, I wish that I could hold those hips. Mm, in the evening of ecstasy. So come and get next to me, girl. Share my passion. Evening with you, that's all that I'm asking. Don't make me flip or trip. Come in, my cutie pie, and be my honey. Yeah. I'm on the girls are so Should I wear that?
some traffic. Rain here, rain at home. There's a boat on the bad weather. So this is Sunset Boulevard. So what? Rain, traffic. That's a special kind of Pretty girls. Here's to you, baby. Daydream is making me absolutely horny. I don't even care if I could have pay for it by now. Girls are very You look very beautiful. Thank you. So are you working? I'm always working. No, I mean, are you working? I'm waiting for a cab, you asshole. Oh, sorry, excuse me. Damn, that was one hell of a rejection. There's probably some hooker in here that wants me. You know what? Maybe chicks have rejected me for some bloody goat to me. I wonder if I shaved it off. Showing. 
man, she's cute. And she's black. Oh, and she's working. I'm new in town, and I uh, was looking for a little bit of fun. Well, what can I do for you? Well, actually, um, I haven't had sex in nine months, so I was a little bit horny. What is a good-looking guy like you doing on Sunset, looking for a hooker? L.A. Well, I'm here for four weddings and a funeral, actually, but we don't talk about that. No, poor thing. Come on, you want to jump in the car? Yeah. Let me slip into something more comfortable. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Can you hold that for you? Yeah. Mm. Nice body. Thank you. I like your hair. Thank you. You have a very beautiful accent. Thank you. Where are you from? England. Oh, English boy. What are you doing here? Oh, here for the publicity work. Oh, yeah? Mm -hmm. What kind of work do you do? I'm an actor. Oh, well, we're going to act, aren't we? You can. So what are you interested in? Uh, would the blowjob be out of the question? Mm, that's fine. Yeah. Okay. All right, folks, let's break it up. LAPD. Let's go out of the car. Come on. Come on. Out of wind. Let's go. Oh, 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 oh Louie! You wouldn't believe who we got. Louie. Get over here. Who is it? Louie, we got us a movie star. Get out over here, buddy. Check it out. Come here. <laughs> Look at this. Come out of the car, please. Oh, we got to get out of the car. Let's take it. Delta 1562. Give me a call on your primary 5574. Okay. Okay, that's all cool at night. Thank you. Right, You know, I've been waiting an hour to use these weights in that bench. Well, I just got out of jail and I need my workout. Sorry. Looks like you do too. So you're gonna have to wait. Fine. Exercise like this. Oh, hi, 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 hi. Gosh, 
How you doing? Fine. As your legal counsel, I've prepared a very good defense in this Sunset Boulevard fiasco of yours. Is that good for contingency? No, honey, you can't pay me on contingency. This is not a lawsuit. This is a legal defense. I want to get paid. Well, how about the good old days? Yeah, about the good old days. Well, huh. Are we alone in here? Yeah, it's a jerk in the back, but I can get rid of him. Some jerk? All right, yeah, go, go, get rid of him, go ahead. Go, go, go. <laughs> oh, nice ass. Excuse me. Excuse me. me oh, pew. Me and my lawyer need some time alone. Could you excuse us? Sure. Excuse me? Oh, God! Well, honey, too. Everybody wants money. More? Oh, gee. Gee, Wes. Great. Now I can get something to eat. I love it. So, oh, has he gone? Mm -hmm. Oh, great. Now, is this, this wasn't your first offense. This was like, what, your second third? Or yeah. Were you picked up by any of the same cops? It was, but as I, you know, was into my dance. When they, when they opened up the door. For a minute, they, they, they sat there and watched, to my imagine, because they were really smooth. You know, they was like really smooth with it. Like they were like tripping out, get our attention. So they were like there. And from my understanding that they kept, he was smashing on the brake. Is that what the police said? <laughs> yeah. You know, that he was smashing on the brake. I guess every it felt good at one point. Mm. <laughs> mm. So the next question is before I go to the police and everything, going to jail, how big is it? Oh, wow. For me to know and you to find out. Uh, wow. <laughs> Let me ask you, is it bigger than four? What's a four? Four inches. I didn't have enough time to measure. It's not, it's not as big as Ron Jeremy's. <laughs> ah, no. <laughs> you want to tell us how big it is? I'll, t I'll, I'll give you a clue. Yeah. He's okay. He He's just okay. likes to be satisfied. He likes to work with it. Yeah. Okay, so for our audience, it's probably about six inches. <laughs> ah, no. <laughs> not at all. Ron? Yes. He pulled it out. He finally pulled he it out. He gave me an exclusive interview. Did he? And what did you do? You must have had a nice reaction to that. Oh, wow. If they're, if they're too big, I don't I don't mess around because they can take a man his ID or his um, car that he had with him. Right. You know, they knew then. I guess it had actress something on. What were the you were doing at that time? When you first got that car? None at all. It, it wasn't like he was a well-known guy. And a smart guy would go to a hotel. At 1.30 in the morning, they let me go. I actually went back to work, back to Sunset. Um, on, you know how you watched your Channel 2 Fox News right. from 7 to 9 in the morning? Right. They had that on there. My boyfriend came down and got me, but he didn't know what had went down earlier that morning. All he knew was that I went to jail and, and that was it. He didn't have no recognition that I told him that they said that I, I was in jail with the movie star, but didn't like, you know, going to the jail, you know. When we were going to the airport and got to the airport and got home, you know, people were like looking at me strange and shit. And I was like, no, they, they're tripping off something else. And it was tons of reporters out in front of my home. They had blocked the streets off and everything. You know, it was really scary at first because I didn't know what was happening. I thought this guy had really gave me a horrible disease or something. <laughs> <laughs> or I gave him something, I didn't know, but it wasn't me because, you know, I'm a very safe woman. I'm, you know, you use condoms. safe sex on everything. You look at me, I'm a condom. <laughs> <laughs> you know, so. <laughs> Till next.